all of our cooks have served up their best savoury Greek pastries. Now it's time for Judge Dan to taste all the dishes without knowing who cooked what. Hey Dan, you struck gold tonight. So what do you think? We have pastries of all different shapes and sizes, which is great. Well, Dan, where do you want to start? Let's start with that one. Okay. This is tiropitakia and spanakopita. Shall I dig in? Go for it. Very tasty. Mm -hmm. Very crispy pastry, nice golden brown. It's a beautiful filling, nice and moist, really cheesy. Should I go for the pie-shaped uh, spanakopita or the um, snail? Get into it, Dan. Mm. Very crispy pastry, nice golden brown filling, super tasty. That cheese, umami, the spinach really nicely cooked. The only thing I say, I guess, would be the pastry probably doesn't have enough, you know, butter. Between layers? Between the layers, yes. I'd like a bit more richness, a bit more crispy, oily, buttery bits. This is pumpkin pastries and four cheese pastries. Interesting presentation, very Greek style, not just the pastries on the plate, a bit of salad, and interesting way of putting the dip on each three corners of the plate. But it's all about the flavour, the texture, and if I enjoy it. Mmm, it's a beautiful filling, nice and moist, really cheesy, but there's so much cinnamon in here, it's really overpowering all the cheeses. Okay, I'm going to try this one here. What was it again, sorry? Pumpkin. Let's break it open. Ooh. The pastry, I, I, I do commend that person for making their own pastry. It is a little thick, but nice sweet and sour filling, especially when you, you eat it with this um, nice sauce here. But overall, not a bad start. So, Dan, these are Cretan cheese calatsunya. First of all, I can tell that they made their pastry themselves, which is great. Really nice bite-sized snacky pastries. They are a little bit blonde, but we'll just have to see. It's a delicious filling. Probably one of the best fillings I've had so far because it's so simple, but Definitely lacking a bit of crunch. Yeah, they are a little bit blonde. Um, I, I would say you probably fry them for a little bit longer. This is spinach pie. Looks like a textbook spanakopita, just cut out out of a big one. That filling, delicious. The pastry, super crispy. The spinach isn't too overcooked. You can taste the feta, and it's actually quite subtle in terms of seasoning because what they did was actually sprinkle some sea salt on the top here. You're a happy man, Dan. Yeah. Okay, Dan, so, I mean, that's all four tasted. Any thoughts on which is the restaurants? Hmm, I do have an idea, but I'm not entirely certain. I'll give you one hint, though. The winning dish did have feta in them. <laughs> <laughs>